Hi, I'm Farmer Andrew, the uh, Director of Farming Operations here at Willisford. Um, I'm a farmer outstanding in his field. It's a bad <laughs> farmer joke. This is uh, our overwintered garlic, and you can see the garlic shoots coming up here, and we mulch it in so that they don't frost heave. There you can see the soil underneath. There's a garlic, and there's a garlic. Oh, and when can folks look forward to consuming some of this? That'll be the first things that'll come off are the flower buds, the garlic scapes in the spring of you know, June of 2024. That's great. And so you've been at Willowsford for about, I don't know, two and a half going on three years this season. What are some of the things that you've learned that the community is looking for in their in their agri-hood? So folks seem they want flexibility, convenience, uh, to have options. Uh, so if you like that, then the custom CSA is a really good option for you. Okay. Um, and engagement. I mean, people have kind of clamored for, you know, more pop-up events at the boathouse. We reopened the farm stand. Um, wanting to get more wagon rides and things where people can get out on the farm. Okay, so it sounds like you have a custom CSA and that's $500 and that's currently on offer on, on the Barn to Door website. Um, beyond that, what are some of the other shares that people... So if the custom CSA isn't your cup of tea, you do have to log in and make choices uh, and, you know, like actually on a weekly basis or whenever you'd like to. Uh, we have a farmer's choice share, which is we choose what goes into the box and you just get the box every week. Uh, we have a flower share from a partner farm. Um, uh, uh, we have meat boxes from Ayrshire Farms and you can get a la carte. You can just order whatever you'd like to. You can shop at the farm stand or shop at, at the pop up at the boathouse. So some people, we've been canvassing the neighborhood and it's our goal to hit all 2,300 plus homes in Willisford because we want more of our community at our farm table. What we've heard is that folks are really, um, you know, maybe they've participated in the share before, mm -hmm. you know, and, and they've kind of gotten like what we've called the farmer's choice share. But this sounds like an option for people who travel frequently, you know, you just don't order food that week. It's su super flexible. Your I know. It's hold over and the nice thing about the custom CSA is you can use it on anything. So if you have honey available on the website, you can use it to purchase honey. You can use it to purchase the meat box. Yeah. Things like that. So it's, you can go through $500. I mean, if you've been to the grocery store, $500 doesn't go where it used to used to at the grocery store either you can there are many ways to to utilize those 500 yeah and, i mean and it's currently mid-january so it's i guess some people are wondering why do i have to sign up for this right now like how does that help the farm so by the best thing about signing up early is i'm in the planning stages right now so i'm ordering seeds and i'm you know purchasing supplies by the time march and april rolls around the plan is kind of is baked into the pie and so it really helps uh, us to plan ahead to say, hey, we need to have X number of, of shares available to, for folks because we're not gonna plant so much excess that we can accommodate on a minute's notice. Well, and it looks like what's sitting right there next to you is a share um, or some offerings that were you know, available this week that are getting delivered actually by Anna today. Can you tell me or show so us some is, of the goodies? Um, so this, this is uh, a couple dozen eggs. So these are from our hens that are out on, on pasture out here to be moved on Friday. Um, delicious. Uh, bok choy out of the field, a bag of spinach out of the field, kale out of the field. It's been a, a nice mild winter. We have a bunch of roots in here too. Carrots, potatoes, beets, onions. We have a box of microgreens, a head of lettuce, things like that. Well, and I think what I've heard from customers is like food from our farm tastes a little different than the stuff you're going to get out of the grocery store, right? Mm -hmm. And I think one of the reasons is like, I know it's, you know, mid-January again, and some of those greens, mm -hmm. they go through like a cold frost cycle, right? Yeah, so that not all food is created equally. So this is green kale out of the field, and you see how like it's a darker green here and a lighter green here. That's actually going to be exceptionally sweet because it... it repeatedly froze and thawed and healed. And sugar is one of uh, a plant's natural defenses against the freeze-thaw cycle, so it's like natural antifreeze. Uh, so the sugars get concentrated in the leaves, the same with the spinach. So uh, fall kale, that looks like this is delicious. That's great. Yeah, such a variety, such a great variety. And the soil health is improving. You know, I know that's been one of your um, strategic goals of things to focus on so we can grow a, a wider variety of food. Yeah. Um, all right, so folks, 
<laughs> sign up for CSA <laughs> if you can. Yeah. Um, if you're not really that interested in doing the farmer's choice, the custom option is a great option for you. You have the flexibility if you travel. Uh, you can use it on multiple items. Uh, if you're a, a really big proponent of the farm stand, we hope to see you when the farm stand opens on a regular basis. The third, I think it's the third or fourth week of May, we'll, we'll advertise it. Um, but yeah, the, the more you get involved in the agri-hood, uh, the better a place um, Willisford can be. You know, you volunteer, t send your kids to farm camp, come to the farm stand, go on a wagon ride. You know, we'd love to have you at the table this year. We certainly would. So sign up for the CSA today. Again, that custom share is great for folks who travel a lot. Um, the egg share does sell out. So, you know, signing up early also helps ensure that the crops are planted just for you and you get access to them. So, all right. Thanks, Farmer Andy. Yep. Have a good one.